It lasted for less than a minute, but the earthquake has devastated the Haitian capital. Hundreds of thousands of survivors still find themselves camping on the streets of the capital. People have lost their houses, they are living under toppling sheets and in a very, very temporary settlement. The emergency room was packed. In less than two days, it was more than 150 lying everywhere. to thank FS who really support us you know, to this moment. And um, that's the only way we can provide you know, this, help, this kind of services you know, to our patients. You know. So what we're planning is not only uh, the food distribution, we will come back and we're committed to stay here and help them in rehabilitating their lives and their livelihoods in the long term as well. Et plus précisément à Vice, qui nous a beaucoup aidé, ok, Et surtout à Tissous, zone Mariani, un dans la distribution des kits alimentaires. Reconstruction efforts face serious challenges, but foremost is the cost. The G7 had been under pressure to help the country's long-term reconstruction by cancelling its debts. With the debt relief, the dollars that we would have been paying on it will go for development, development of Haiti. Thanks, Abbas, for your support. We need to rebuild the country, and we hope with the solidarity that you are giving to us, we will continue and help rebuild Haiti.